In this journey we are going to visit the Well of Dreams. But first we are going to connect with the heart of the earth. Start by sitting comfortably or lying down. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath in. And out. Let all tension in your body disappear. Imagine it all sinking into the ground. Starting with your feet. All tension in your feet and your toes. All melting away and sinking into the ground. And your ankles. Up your calves and your shins to your knees all tension melting away breathing in peace and breathing out anything you do not need at the moment all tension from your thighs dissolves. All tension in your hip joints and your pelvis and your buttocks dissolve. All tension working up each individual vertebrae of your spine dissolves and dissolves in bands round your abdomen up to your navel and up to your diaphragm and take a deep breath in and when you breathe out imagine all tension in your diaphragm drift away and all tension in your chest and your back and your shoulders take a breath in tense up your shoulders and relax let all that tension drift away now all tension in your upper arms and your elbows sink away into the earth and your lower arms and your hands and each and every finger tension just dripping off them replaced with nice calm relaxed feelings all tension in your neck now dissolves and your jaws, your eyes and your face and your forehead and your head all the way up to the crown of your head. All tension dissolves away. Now imagine you're sinking through the earth, feeling very protected and not at all claustrophobic but you're just sinking through the earth. First of all you sink through the bed or the chair or if you're outside you start sinking straight into the earth. And you sink through the various levels of rock and earth into various caverns filled with crystals never before seen by human eyes and through in a dreamy state sinking and sinking further and further into the earth until you're sinking so fast it's like you're falling and as you fall through all these layers of the earth's crust you feel this bliss of abandonment knowing that you're totally safe and totally secure at all times but you still feel yourself falling further and further down through chambers through various strata of rock you may be aware of different beings around you 
different energies. You may go through some warm areas and some cooler areas. You may be even able to smell some of the different smells and taste some of the different tastes as you, you sink down, almost falling down through the earth's crust, faster and faster. The world surface now far above you as you enter the mantle of the earth. This liquid layer, this warm liquid layer of liquid rock, as you fall through this, in a blissful state, noticing any beings, noticing how wonderful it is and how safe and secure you feel, falling further and further through different layers of the mantle, noticing the different temperatures and the different energies, and sensing the different beings that form part of the earth, until you reach the silver liquid outer core and start to sink through that very quickly as you notice a different metallic type of beings here the metallic smells and tastes and the warmth and cradling of the earth until you slow down and slow down so instead of falling you're now sinking sinking like a feather and you slowly rest upon the solid iron core of the earth and you look up and you can see in your mind's eye all the different layers and you can see right out through the earth into the cosmos you feel safe, cradled and secure it's a wonderful sensation now you imagine yourself slowly sinking into the core of the earth itself it embracing you in a loving way and as you do so your body changes into solid metal and you slowly start to rise up again and rest on the core made of solid metal and far above you is a blue white brilliant light of Deneb shining on you and this shines down on your metal body you can feel yourself warming at first tingling all through your metal body now you can feel some movement as your metal body starts to liquefy and you become like mercury still holding your form but as a liquid form and you start to rise through the outer core the metallic outer core and the energies come down warmer and warmer higher and higher energies from Deneb this blue white crumbly light this amazing sensation and the liquid starts to boil and you become a being of gas very light and now charging through the mantle of the earth as if an air filled boy charging through the sea rising very quickly in a most euphoric way as the denim energies, the sparkly tingly energies which you can taste as smell and hear as well as see make you so full of vibrant energy that your gas turns to flame as you pass through the crust of the earth through all the different caverns and all the different layers you're like a body made of fire and by the time you reach the surface your energies have changed once again so you're now made of pure light. You may notice when you look around that you're in the same room as you started, but you feel profoundly anchored to the centre of the earth, but at the same time so light you could float away. 
You also notice you can see things that you couldn't see before. You can see energy. You can sense things. Things seem a lot more colourful. Your hearing seems a lot more acute. Everything is amplified. Sense of smell, sense of taste, sense of touch. Now you take a look around you for a minute, getting used to what it's like to be astral. And you slowly start to float up. And you float up into the sky, further and further up, until you can see the place you were shrinking below you as if you were flying in a plane or a hot air balloon. And you travel through the clouds and you notice that there are angelic beings in the clouds. Angelic beings singing harmonious music. They go further and further up into the atmosphere of the earth. Further up, still sensing the Deneb light, for you are in the cone of Deneb light. And you go up, and you notice other beings, huge energy beings that form part of the atmosphere, miles and miles wide. You slowly leave the atmosphere of the Earth and see the jewel of the planet beneath you, floating above it, feeling totally free and wonderful. As you float up until the Earth shrinks, but you notice that you have a profound connection to the Earth, either through this unbreakable cord or just through a feeling of profound connection. And you see the moon too, and the sun. The sun is shining on you now. When you're aware of the moon and its majesty, you see it a lot closer than you've ever seen it before. And just beyond the moon, glimmering portal, and you instinctively grow closer to it. This is the entry point to the well of dreams. Slowly move towards it, and you see, as you get there, that there is a big energetic doorway made of sparkling light, and outside it are some angels, the guardians of the doorway, who make sure no lower energy forms can get through. And as you approach, the angels allow you through. The doorway parts, and you find yourself standing in a meadow on the Well of Dreams. In this meadow is the most wonderful meadow. There's most wonderfully warm, vibrant energy to it. You feel connected to everything here. Everything seems to sing with its own music as you walk through this meadow. And there before you is a guide. It may be your personal guide your guardian angel, or it may be a guide from the Well of Dreams. The guide takes you by the hand and leads you through this lovely field into a forest. The forest is like no forest you've ever seen. The light comes from a star, which is not the sun, it's like Deneb, it's this diffuse blue star, and dapples through the trees. It feels very dreamlike, but very real. As you walk through the trees of this forest, the dappling light as your guide leads you along. And eventually you come to the crystal temple. An enormous structure made of pure crystal. When you enter the temple, when you stand in the space in the middle, and the energy is channeled down into you. You feel this wonderful energy channel through your head, your neck, your arms, your back, your chest, your diaphragm, your abdomen, your pelvis, your buttocks, your thighs, your knees, your calves, 
your shins on your feet and sink into the floor. It's a wonderful, peaceful energy. And you feel lighter and lighter in this energy, almost sleepy, but in a blissful way. As you sink into this state of wonderful bliss, wonderful healing, and you close your inner eyes, and just experience this light, experience floating around in this wonderful light which is infusing your entire body with a very gentle but powerful healing energy. And feel it swirling around you. It's got an intense heat which is not an unpleasant heat. It's like no heat you could ever experience in your physical body. The light also is intense, but not in a way that hurts your eyes, and also in a way that still has substance, a sort of crumbly substance, but very light. Then you sink back to the floor, you find yourself lying there, when you open your eyes, the guide then takes you by the hand again. You walk out of the temple with your guide and through this forest. There's all sorts of exotic birds in this forest and flowers, some that you've never seen before for they never grow on earth and trees, some massive trees, some small trees, trees that you can recognise and trees that you've never seen before. You take a couple of minutes just to explore this forest. Explore the different flowers. Maybe smell a few and feel the petals of a few. Go over to some of the trees and feel what it's like to touch the trunk of the tree. Maybe even hug the tree. And feel the energy. Feel how much lighter and more vibrant it is. You recognise this tree as an energy being such as yourself. Then you walk along the path a bit more until you can hear a waterfall. A wonderful sound of a cascading waterfall. The guide guides you down the path to a cave round the back of the waterfall. You stand in this cave and watch the water cascading in front of you. Go forward and stand in the cascading water. You will feel the water pass right through you and fill you with millions upon millions of sparkling tiny rainbows from your head to your toes. This is the water of purification as it cascades down upon you totally enveloping you. You can taste it, you can taste its purity. You can feel it. It's a shivery cold feeling, but a wonderful feeling as well. Your body seems alive with these sparkling rainbows. And below you, you see this pool of crystal clear water and you jump in. And you swim in this pool. You feel it wonderfully invigorating. Feeling the light of the diffuse light source above you. Hearing the waterfall and seeing all the rainbows sparkling off it. You can swim to the bottom and look at all the different rocks and crystals that are in the bottom. All the different coloured stones. All that seem to have this amazing energy as you feel this water embrace you this wonderfully crystal clear amazingly tasting pure smelling water it's now time for you to continue your exploration so your guide takes you by the hand and you walk up by the waterfall and across a crystal bridge this bridge 
crosses a ravine and you can see below you this river and you cross a bridge and find yourself in a rocky mountainscape a gorge and from here the guide takes you to a high point where you can see for miles you can see the forest and the crystal temple in distance you can see the meadow and the portal where you entered you can see the waterfall and you look over and see mountains and seas and an infinite expanse of land and you walk round these rocks and they feel wonderful and warm and embracing and you sit against these rocks and as you sit there you feel yourself sinking through like you did before at the beginning of this journey but not into the earth but into the centre of the well of dreams you sink through the rocks a falling sensation as you go through the various levels of rock and of energy when you pass through a huge expanse of milky blue white light and meet all the beings there who form part of the well of dreams you pass through until you eventually reach the core of the well of dreams this core is made of pure crystal a pure smooth clear quartz crystal and you rest on top of this crystal and you slowly sink into the crystal a wonderful sensation as you become clear quartz and slowly you start to move up again you move on to the surface of this crystal feel the wonderful blue white energies infuse you the crystal turns into liquid crystal start to float up through the layers as this liquid crystal turns to gas and to flames you find yourself standing on top of the rocks turned to astrolite once again but this time even more refined than you were before the guide tells you that there are many levels to the universe the well of dreams is one of the first levels and you can work up different levels using this process going through new portals getting lighter and brighter all the time and this is the evolution of humanity to evolve through this system but for just now it is enough just for you to experience this and your guide slowly takes you down the mountain and you take one last look at the view and you cross the crystal bridge and look at the waterfall and the forest you walk through the forest seeing the different trees the different grasses, the different flowers and see them in a new vibrance in a new way you walk past these and past the temple you walk down the grassy meadow which seems even more alive and vibrant now than it ever did until you get to the portal there you can say goodbye to your guide in whichever way you wish they may wish to give you a gift of some sorts Once you have said your goodbyes, the portal opens and you fly out of the portal. Angels smiling at you. The portal closes behind you and again you can see the sun, the earth and the moon and you see them in a new way. There's a new vibrance to them. You float past the moon, finding out that you can go in any direction at any speed just by the power of thought might actually like to go down and visit the moon briefly looking at its craters 
and its hills, and looking at the view of the earth from the moon, as you take off once again towards the earth. And as you enter the atmosphere you see all the angelic beings and all the huge energy beings that form part of the atmosphere. And you float down past the clouds where they're playing the wonderful music back down to the place you started this journey. You rest gently into your physical body. You become aware of where you are sitting or lying. You become aware of the sensations of your physical body. You become aware of the sounds of the room that you're in or wherever you are. You become aware of any smells or any tastes. You become aware of the air. Is it warm or cold, dry or damp? You take a deep breath in and out. All the time become more aware of the physical world. Take another deep breath in and out. And a third. In and out. It's a wonderful feeling. Now flex your fingers and toes. Take another deep breath in and when you're ready open your eyes and stretch.